So welcome again. And if, uh, as a lot have done already, uh, said hi, where you're from in the chat, how's the weather? That's always fun. And if you are new to the call, and I think I'm seeing some new names. Uh, if you're new to the call, we would love to know that. Or, well, and if you're new to Zentangle. So we'd like to know both of those. And, and of course, where you're from and all of that. So um, this is fantastic. And then housekeeping wise, um, as uh, just, just for those that, that uh, might be new, is we do keep, we keep the webcams off except for mom and myself. So that way those on smaller screens can see easy. And then also uh, keeping, uh, keeping the conversation in the chat uh, is helpful because it's hard to, it's hard to hear. And then too, I, I, I was finding myself, it was a couple times where I, I, I get, I, it's easy to get off in the weeds as we're just kind of chatting and having fun and we're paying attention to the chat and we'll, you know, um, kind of talk with the chat. And then if we need to have somebody open to, to explain or something, we'll let you know, because that just seems to work easiest. And then also too, for everyone's enjoyment, it's a lot of times hard to hear with um, just different bandwidths and, you know, and some, you know, times the mics aren't so great and it's choppy and hearing and all that kind of nonsense. So anyway, we just want to make it easy and have everyone have a lot of fun. So with that, Oh, well, Storm, we're glad that you're in. You know, I, hope, I hope you feel better soon with you on that. Let's see. Is it? Um, oh, Kexi, it's probably on your end. So, uh, there's probably something that makes it switch orders or something like that. Because I think you guys all see us side by side. And where I see mom's is big and mine is a little thing in the corner. So it's. Um, well, that's so weird. Really Why is that, Heather? I just, I, I'm going to have to ask them. Because it'd be I nice to. <laughs> You should be able to change that. It, yeah, I should be able to. It, it'd be nice to be able to set that um, for us, and so I'll have to let them know. They make an assumption that you know, you know, I don't know. I, I like to have it. Have well, you it know equal. what? Now, on when I'm doing it. No, no, wait. No, I can't. Oh, if I click on I'm on mine, I'm small in the corner. Right. And I click on it, and it gets big. Yeah, yeah, Did it'll do that? that. Yes, yeah. When I need to see mine, I, I just click on it and I'm like, oh, okay, oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and and for everyone else too, if you want to, if you want to close in on either one of us, you just tap or click on either picture and it'll make it bigger. So just so you know that. Okay, so we're gonna do the Tangle Arben by CZT Gildo Sobrino, and I'm gonna put in the chat the link. And two links. The second one will be to his Instagram. Um, yeah, no, um, we have the, the gallery view is grayed out. Because I think it's only if we have if we have a whole bunch uh, of people. So then it will do the, the gallery view or the spotlight view. So it's really funny. Um, oh, <laughs> tapping on the screen. <laughs> Wait, are you on a desktop or are you on a laptop that doesn't have a touch screen? <laughs> I'll wait to find out. <laughs> that's what I thought. <laughs> oh, that's funny. You know, it's funny when you get used to that. And like, I have a laptop that has a, a touch screen, um, one of them. And, and then I'm like, going, oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, I can tap on that. I totally forgot. That's so funny. Okay, so I've got the two. Um, the two things in the chat. Let me share my screen. Well, it's just as good as us pointing and, and, and talking. It's like, oh, yeah, you can't see me pointing. <laughs> or or our never cursor's do moving. <laughs> right, right. Yeah, the only time that you can see that is, when, oh, look at, yeah, my cursor's moving on on, uh, on the shared screen. That's the only time you can see it. Although I still do the point thing, and I'm like, no, they can't see that, Heather. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> All right, so this is a really neat tangle and really simple but so many different ways you can do it because it is uh, especially if we treat it as a fragment um so the tangle itself so this would be a grid pattern and we start off with little bumps kind of like crescent moon if you've done that uh tangle so little bumps along whatever edge that you want to have be the base then curved lines coming from so 
uh, we, I don't think we had any confusion with this, which was nice. So on each bump, we're going to do the, uh, we'll start with the, say, the left side, making a curve line up to the right corner on all of them, and then doing the opposite. So the right, from the right corner of the bump all the way to the left corner. So you create these neat arches. And then um, he has just uh, filling in that center diamond. And then shading and having fun. And I'm going to say, you know, the, even filling in that center diamond, of course, you could do something else if you think of, you know, something else neat to do in there. But what's cool is treating it as a fragment. And so as a there's the, the concept of fragments and reticula that Zentangle, gosh, launched, it's been a while now. And the reticula is is the grid or the structure. It's just a grid not necessarily assigned to being square or rectangle. It can be anything. And now, because they were looking for a name that would fit everything instead of just, you know, because when you think grid, you think, you know, like a checkerboard or something like that. So what you can do with the fragment, which this, the, the, the tangle itself would be the fragment, is you can uh, have it go in any direction you want. So like in, uh, well, actually, let me just show his work. So here's his tangle. And that's the, this is that second link that I put up. And, and then here is his sample. And that's, that's what I did was I did the, the top row one way and then flipped, uh, you know, flipped it, did, this, did it in the opposite way. So it was mirrored. And that's how you get this neat pattern. But you could flip it different ways. You could do it opposite, or or actually like like the middle two here, where you put the the um the little bumps on the up upper and upper and lower, and then ha you know and have it so that way it's just the middle here is a really really neat tangle. Or you could do it sideways. I might try to do it sideways or something. I was thinking of doing it something completely different. So. Um. So, yeah. Would you so, mind scrolling up a little more on the desktop uh, picture, Heather? Uh, this Thank one. You. Oh, look at that! Wow. Oh, yeah, these are these are no, just that, other. Yeah, that. Yeah, these are just other of his works. It's not. Oh, uh, they're not the same. Okay, I'm right, sorry. I thought right. they were the same thing. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah, I I had done that too. Yeah, it, it's just this is just the sample that that he's got. Although I could probably no. Let's see. I don't think he has. If he has a hashtag, but um. But then, but then sometimes you find a lot of other stuff too, which we won't. I I could have explored that beforehand. So, um. So anyway, so that's the tangle and lots of fun. All right, let me stop my screen share, and I think I'm going to work on a white tangle. What are you going to work on? And see, your mom did it in a circle. So if you want to show that again, um, and did it just the one direction, and then right. had extra fun with it, and then did other <laughs> things with it. <laughs> It looks so neat. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sure. use a gray one, but I'm okay. gonna use a square. Okay. Well, I'm gonna use a square too, and I think I'm gonna do. Um, so this one was was just four squares. I think I'm gonna do more than that, so I can have maybe extra fun. We'll see. We'll see. But this is such a nice, easy tangle to do. Um. Oh, and maybe, 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 maybe. I was going to use blue. Well, why not? <laughs> I'm going to uh, I'll go back into to Delft mode. And, um, you know, it was, it, well, with the circle that you did, Mom, that kind of shows that you don't have to um, have a grid that's straight. Right. But I had, you know, I had kind of, I don't know what you call that. Trapezoid? No, that's not it. Anyway, oh, uh, rhombus, you know, rhombus. Yeah, rhombus. it was just kind of like a a wedge, a cut off wedge, which worked good. I used my yeah. storm. I I used my cheaty thing and made two bands, and then di and divided the the whole thing into sections before I started. So, yeah, so I think I'm gonna do well, however many this is. <laughs> My brain isn't wanting to help. My brain is just wanting to tangle. Oh, Heather, you're asking for trouble. I am. 
because I'm bacheloretting it this weekend. So this is the kind of trouble that I get into. <laughs> we should, <laughs> oh, we should invent, we should make a tangle bar. Instead of serving drinks, we'll serve pieces of paper and pens. <laughs> okay, Andrew. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, and I think, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm, I think I'm going to do, well, I don't know. I, I think I might just do the outside, all putting, having the uh, the bumps on the outer so that's all pointing in. And one suggestion for these is start oh, in the middle of your of your box to put a bump. And then that way, then you can space the other two out. So if you can get the first one as close to center as possible, then that's helpful. You know what? Well, see, when I do it smaller, it's uh, even better. Although I just realized, well, on the corners, well, I just get to choose because I started in the corner and that's the way it's going. And if I flip it, it's just going to be how it turns out. And that's going to be fun. I think, too, you could probably play with... Um, a little bit the size of these the bumps like if they were you know taller although what once you once it's uh we get it all done you could always fill in so like you know it's set, like here's the here's the bumps i mean you could fill in more of those sections if that was something that uh moved you i still can't get them evenly across well, not that it matters but It would be nice. Oh, maybe I do this. One, two, three. Turn. Had I been thinking, I could have done one on a corner, maybe. The next time. <laughs> oh, and you know what? Let me. I'm gonna do this before I go on and do these. The next set. I'm gonna at least let me do at least do these. These three, okay, and what did I say? What did you do with that last one? You have oh, I turned it, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do oh, three, and then turn okay. them three, so that way it'll still be consistent, but that way it's not like I have these, these going this way, and then just two going in. That was, that was my modification for that. Oh. Okay, Shulamit. Oh, only getting audio in. Oh, no. All right. So then from the bumps, and I found it easier to go from the side of the bump, kind of like the takeoff and land idea. So left side to the right corner. Oh, actually, I might as well do, do all of those while I have the tile in this direction. <laughs> You know, honestly, it, it, I love tangles that you can stop almost at any point and say, "That's neat," because that is neat. Just the just the one one half, and then I am turning mine because that way I get that nice uh, curve. Uh, hello. Oh, hello. Who um, am I hearing? I came, Hi, Sharon. I came, hello. Um, I came late, and oh, so okay. I have a question. Yes. Um, which one are we doing? The one with the many squares or the one with the the four squares? The which, one with the many. <laughs> I, it, it, whichever one you want. Um, let me see. Um, we're both yeah, doing it's, the it's, same it's, angle. We're just doing it differently. Right. Oh, okay. Right. So, yeah, so um, want, yeah, go back and check the the um step out. Yeah, let me let me I'm gonna re-put that in there just so you have it. Um but yeah, so yeah, so Sharon, so here the, the tangle itself is I'll do it in just this one square, and the, you see the step out 
has six box. Well, actually, it's five five steps technically, and um, or five boxes that are instructions. And the last one on mine is the um, is the like the four square. But all we're doing is you know, make your grid, and the, the grid can be however you want it to be, and then. We're, we're, like, we're just playing with this. Oh, and I like that, Mom. I was thinking about that, putting them all going, just alternating um, each one in, uh, each one going in just a different direction. But that's that's what you can do with it. Is you can you can place this however you want in uh, each subsequent grid. But we just start with putting these bumps on the bottom, and then making curve lines from. Uh, like this one is from the left side of the bump to the corner, to the right corner. And we just do that for all of them. And then going from the right side of the bump to the left corner, or, you know, opposite there. And then, actually I didn't do that on these. Then it's, you can, if you want, fill in this diamond unless you have a another great idea for, um, you know, for decorating, but we have it filling in this center diamond. And then we can have fun and, you know, play and shade. And, um, you know, if you wanted to add other tangles, you could. But hope that makes sense. I'm thinking too, maybe the one that you've, um, let's see. Yeah, because the one in the second link is say if you had clicked on the, the links already, and I'm just going to put it in here for good measure, the second one, um, to the Instagram, that one, it pops up with one, two, three, four. Oh, I guess that would be a 16 grid, kind of what I'm doing, but I'm doing mine in a different configuration. That's the word. Oh, and I'm just... It's just occurring to me, and I don't know why it's just occurring to me that on his sample, he's colored in like a V shape in, you know, in the outer sides. And, um, yeah, it filled in different areas than what's on the step out. So that's just neat. That's the fun of this one, depending yeah. on what, what you color in or don't color in can look different. And that looks, yeah, because I was thinking about that. Yeah, if you if you just uh, put put the little bumps on a different side each time. And then, yeah, I think my worst thing in this one is just getting these little guys to be spread across evenly. And maybe have somewhat close of a similar size and shape. But thank goodness that with the fill-in, I can kind of adjust some of it by shifting it, you know, coloring over a little bit. Oh, and that's right. I'm going to do this one. Let me just mark it because that way I won't move it. And then I'll decide what I do in the middle. <laughs> I like that with what you're doing in, inside the the you know where where the bumps are and making it all shiny like that. Yeah, I I don't think doing it this way makes as interesting of an overall pattern. Mm hmm But that's okay. Yeah. But I'm not done yet. <laughs> I was just gonna say. But what could you do? Hmm. You know, in the the tops, like when I first saw um, his, the um, Gildo's sample, and for whatever reason, I was thinking like jester hats. Oh. Huh. And maybe it's just the you know the way, and even here, you know, just the way they kind of. Oh yeah, it does look like that. Yeah. And I think that that's just where my brain was going with that.
mean, there are a couple tangles that look jester-ish. There's a jester stick, and I think we did one. I think we did one. Maybe it was last. I don't think it was Christmas. Maybe it was in March. That was something to do with jesters. I think. Hmm. I'm, as I'm doing, I'm thinking, oh, yeah, Jenna Grace, yeah, I looked up, like, yeah, gesture's hat or a scepter, yeah. And then, it, too, depending on how you you color it, because him uh, filling in, I guess it would be, he filled in the two, these two sections that are connected to that inside diamond, and that just really makes it look that way. Cherie, yours looks like a reticula. It is. Yeah, I'm thinking, yeah, well, you know, and, and have you tried that stir it up, Mom? It, were you asking me something? Yeah, yeah. Have I tried what? <laughs> The, the the stir it up tangle. No. And I'm not going to. I'm adding it to uh, Knightsbridge. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking, well, that might look interesting in the uh, in that in those. I'm I'm just kind of going around, and yeah. the, and then and then deciding what what I can do with the rest of the open. Spaces, yeah. Let me speak to you. Yes. But it, yeah, there is a, there is a certain neatness with it, even though it's you know without it, with having it kind of disconnected that way. Just like having them just all going the same direction is kind of neat, too. Oh, and I just thought of something. <laughs> oh, Kim, see. yeah. Love the repetition of this tangle. It, yeah, and that it's easy. Well, it's nice, too, to have, you know, almost too much, you know, room for, oh, what can I do? We just don't want to get have that overwhelmed um, this with it. So, like I, we were talking about how it looks very stained glassy. Hmm, I think I'm kind of liking this. I have to like it. I'm doing it. <laughs> Oh, I haven't filled in. Like, why does it look different? You know, you don't. Cause looking at the difference between not filling in that center thing and doing that, you. I mean, it's one of those you don't have to. Now I'm almost thinking I should have waited, but oh well. Because it kind of has a really neat look. It. it uh, in my mind, I was thinking this one uh, caught my eye because of. Uh, our Tough Tangle Tuesday and doing loop, which is, it has all these nice lines and is kind of spirography looking. It's probably just the, you know, reticular activating system that says, oh, now you're going to find all of these like that. Oh, that looks neat, Mom. Well, let's see. Wait, now, wait. <laughs> it's like, Cassie, now I tell you. <laughs> well, let's see. Since I've just started, then Cassie, maybe we can double check and see if, if uh, well, although we know there's no right and no wrong. 
as long as you're going from the from you know the left side of the the bump to the right corner and then flipping it going the other way from the remember what i just said but the right oh i see where one could Ooh, either oh wait a minute i was say either mess up feel like you mess up but it could be really interesting oh just had an idea an idea of a tangulation maybe <laughs> Oh, I nice. like what I did. But what I about? I just don't. I'm I'm, I'm debating what what else to do. Well, but what about the 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 big? Yeah, the, that section. Would you want to do the same? Well, I don't know because by doing just those three, that makes that a new pattern. It does. And then what else? What could you do different? I have and I'm also thinking pineapple. pineapple. I, don't know why. <laughs> I think it's just it's the top thing. <laughs> oh yes, Cassie understand. Cassie, Cassie says I think I. Uh, she wasn't sure. She wasn't sure if it's right. I think I did, but looking at it makes me think I didn't. If that makes sense, it makes complete sense. <laughs> makes complete sense. I'm, let me uh, let me formulate my thought here. What was I thinking? I was thinking. Oh, and you know. Oh, fooey. Uh oh, what fooey? It's okay. Oh, I, I know. Grabbed what I a brown pen. Oh, maybe I should just go with that. No. <laughs> yeah. Didn't want to grab the brown pen. Yeah. But maybe uh, yeah. I but... get there now. <laughs> Okay. Never mind. Yeah, Cassie, you wanna, yeah, open up and show. Yeah, let's see. Oh, that looks neat, though. Oh. Let's see. Oh, I see. You you have you have them coming from the middle of the orbs. Oh, but that looks really yeah. neat. <laughs> she invented a new tangle. Yeah, there we have a tangulation number one. Yeah, so that's what I say. Yeah, so if you, if you, uh, let's see. So if you look, it's coming from, instead of the center of the orb, or the, the little bump. So you're going from the left side, kind of tracing that little bit of it, coming up to the right. That part is right, where you're, you're having it go to the right or left. Um, corner but you go from mm -hmm. the outside of the bump and you do each bump and then the other way from the other uh so what is this right side of the bump to the left corner yeah, it just for some reason looks wrong yeah you know because you went you went from the center of the bumps oh but it looks cool so <laughs> so keep, keep it. so well, we will so try another one okay <laughs> yeah, so instead of doing it right at the, because yeah, you came up up the center and went to both sides. Uh huh. So you see, and I don't know if you can see. Maybe it's easier on this on the bigger one. Wait. Okay, I'm gonna shut the video off because that way I can see oh, better. Okay, yeah, see better. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So I, I'm I'm doing this to block the other half there. There. So when you have the bumps, then it's you know. Pick whichever way. So if I start on the on the left side of the bump, and I'm taking that curve line up to the corner, left side of this bump all the way up, and do that for all three. Okay. And then I'm going on the right side of the bump, all the way to that corner, and doing that on all three. Yeah, you just had had it right coming from the center. Oh, I didn't notice that it. I knew. Yeah. yeah. So that's. But Whoops. it looks. And Jen says, "Yeah, it's 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 um." It it's arbanesque, yeah, but yes, it still looks neat. So, but yeah, when you try it again, it's just yeah that way you almost you have lines on either side of each bump going to the you know the corners. Okay, so it's not exactly 
wrong. It's just it's a it's adjacent. A yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. a tangulation. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Because there's no wrong. Hey, guys. Hey, Zelda. Oh, there's my way. Oh, yes. Hi. Let's see your way. <laughs> yeah, my oh. way. Oh, see, that's what I was thinking. doesn't look anything like Both yours sides. either. Uh, <laughs> I was thinking. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. And then I couldn't remember. Yeah, yeah. Four lines. So yeah. Back to the drawing board. Yeah, no, but you could you could have so much fun with that because you have yeah you just have more lines going to each corner. Because as I was doing it, I'm like, well, what if? Hmm. That would be why only one of my triangles actually turned out diamond shape. There, the right. other two were wonky. Yeah. Well, out here you you only get one. You do only get one diamond shape right here in the from the center one. Yeah, my, uh, the ones, they're, the bottom two, or top two, whichever way you're looking at it, they're fine. It's the other set that's not. Yeah. Which I yeah. think is the original set, and my lines just didn't add up. <laughs> but. Oh, but yeah. now, go and do it, you, what if you did it, it'll be a lot of lines, but you could go back and put the, you'd go on the right and the, you know. And do it over. You'll just have a, have a lot of lines, and it might look neat. And Zelda, I thought that that looked neat. And then she just has, you know, what a, like a cluster of diamonds in the center, so you can have a lot of fun, you know, filling in or you know, coloring in sections. Well, I didn't know what I was going to put in the middle, so I get yeah, I could just put the lines there anyway. Yeah, exactly. Hmm. That's what's that's, that's what, I don't know. That's what I find fun about. It's like when we when I oops. Um, and then it's uh, you're figuring out, well, okay, now what? <laughs> and, oh, let's see. Yeah, and now I I'm didn't... a different now what. Hmm. Your series is amazing. Yep. And I'm going to mute now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, that does, see, that looks neat. You know what? It almost... Kind of looks ar like ar argoyle, argo argyle, argyle, ish, and that's just the diamonds, I think, and the alternating. And what did you do, cheesecloth in there? Yeah, in oh. brown because I picked up a brown pen. <laughs> but I like it. Yeah, it just makes it different. Yeah. I might, I might use the brown pen somewhere. Oh, I might, I know what I'll do. To you know, kind of carry it through the pattern. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm now I'm I'm at a I'm at a crossroads. <laughs> ah. I could do a, something completely different in the center. <laughs> I can't decide which direction to go with them. Well, I'm going to ponder on that, and while I ponder on that, I'm going to get a get a something to uh, uh to shade with. I'm going to shade with some blue. And sure, I am. If I can get it out, there we go. That looks amazing, and um. So if, if anyone is having, you know, a challenge figuring out, well, what, what, you know, how to decorate these, you know, in the middle, doing an aura and, you know, coloring on the outside or the inside, um, you could add lines, you could add orbs, um, or you could just shade, you know, and leave it, leave it like that. Yeah. It looks like fish tails or whales tails. It could look like that on too. Sher on Cherise. Yeah. <laughs> I have two shapes on each square that I haven't done anything in yet. Uh, Which means. Oh, I see. <laughs> 
I mm -hmm. have oh, oh I I just had an idea. Well, uh, no, I don't know. I don't think I like that idea. Never mind. <laughs> I just had, you know, I didn't have it. Just have an idea. I was going to do something else in brown, but I don't know if I like that or not. And I, I was going to do like print off, but I don't, I don't know if I want to bring anything that oh. circular into this. Okay. I think instead I'm just going to do this. I'm just shading at the tips because that's all I can think of that I know I want to do. Oh, that looks neat. Oh, that looks really neat. Yeah, filling in extra lines. Oh, that's right. I'm using white, so I can't use. Well, I could. It's not going to really have any effect, though. The white. What you call it? <laughs> Chalk pencil. Hmm. Well, I'm going to do that first, and then I'll see where it goes. Um, what do you use for the white coloring? Uh, I'm really new at this. Oh, that's okay, Shan. So, um, which it's it's a white gel pen. Which brand were you using? Oh, oh, I was using the Signo, but um, I also have a just a regular gel pen, mm -hmm. and then. The white charcoal, my stubby white, white charcoal. charcoal. Yeah, yeah, charcoal pencil it's like or, a, or a white pastel pencil. They call it a chalk pencil, but white chalk. But okay. yeah, it's a, yeah, it's not for the solid coloring in white. It's more for highlighting and things like that. Well, and that's what you used in the bottom part above the bumps. Right? Yeah. In here. Yeah. yeah. Can, I see, can, can I see what you use for the, that white piece? That white coloring? What right you there? Call? Where I'm pointing? If you. No, no. Not not the shading, but the actual oh. white. Oh, yes, that oh. one. Yeah. Um. Well, this is a Signo. Uniball. Uniball, Uniball Signo. You okay. can get them on Amazon. Uniball Signal gel pen, white gel pen. Yep. Yeah. It's thicker. Thank you. Yeah, it's sure. thicker than Great. the Jelly Roll brand gel pen number 10. Just remind bit. her, you guys, that if she opens it, she needs to use it so it doesn't dry out. Yeah, we, we've had these conversations that we all get uh, gel pens and all kinds of colors, and then all of a sudden, you know, we've had them for years and they don't work anymore. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, you so you got to keep them closed? Is that what you're saying? Um, no, yeah, use I, it. Yeah, just use, use them. them. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Use it up within a year? <laughs> oh, a month. Yeah. <laughs> no, probably have a, probably have a you know, a, a couple, because I've had some for a good number of years, and some of them Am I the, is more of the, the Jelly Roll brand that it was some of them Rogers. I'd have problems and some I wouldn't. So Yeah, that, that's the same way with mine. I have a whole set and two or three colors that these are I've had for a long time. And there'll be two or three colors that keep just keep working just fine. <laughs> and then others that, you know, newer sets that all of a sudden one will stop working now you know now that i did this part that i just did i don't like it but that's uh -oh. i'm staying with it <laughs> it's like brown microns dry up yeah uh, yeah <coughs> and and that i know because uh, I, I had called them because i had some that like, <coughs> the brown microns that that dried up and i think they they there was a problem or something because they seemed to know about it and offered to 
exchange them, which I thought was very, very nice. But, um, I've read different things and I can't remember. And I have to go back. This is going to be like, like, a like what I try to remember, uh, okay, pigment ink or dye dye ink, you know, wow. like from stamp pans. I was like, Karen and I have to, every single time we're like, wait, what? Or even the, the Tim Holtz ones, it's like, which does what again? And we're always having, we need to just make flashcards. One's <laughs> opaque and one's transparent, but I never remember which is which. Right. Exactly. And so like the storing of the pens is like, I'm going to have to go look it up because on, uh, for the jelly rolls, uh, Sakura, it's either Sakura of America is their website or Sakura USA, I forget. Um, but they have in their frequently asked questions section, and I I need to probably post it somewhere on my site to, just to for easy access, um, you know, on how to store them because I, heard, you know, you know, oh, don't uh, store them vertically. No, store them up. And I can't remember what they said. They, they talked about more about making sure that the cap is on securely because it does have a little bit of a seal in there. And um, so it was just interesting. And but yeah, I don't keep them for, for, for 10 years. And <laughs> like I buy them like, oh, I, oh, I hear they are. And I'll never, ever, ever see them again. So I must buy all of the colors right now <laughs> because they're going out of stock. <laughs> <laughs> or it's just, oh, that's a really good sale. So I have to take <laughs> advantage of it. And if you don't buy them, then they do go away. <laughs> right? And then you're like, oh, I knew it. <laughs> and then it reinforces you know, oh, the sickness. Oh, so funny. I'm kind of glad I didn't get that big 100-piece set of jelly rolls that I <laughs> saw at the holidays. Oh. No, it just means that you have to tangle a lot. Yeah, I don't use my gel pens that often, though. Yeah. I still have the, the gel pens I got over the holidays, and by the sounds of it, I'm kind of lucky they're still working. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, yeah, and maybe they've improved them, too, over 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 time. Um, <laughs> Zella says, it's new, new, new. I must have it. Yes. What? A new shade of, oh, don't even say anymore. <laughs> You just impulse buy everything. Oh, it's just bad. Yes. Oh, I kind of, I, I still don't know what to do in the middle of mine. And we have 15 minutes. I have a lot of time to figure that out. I wish I had, well, wish I had, wish I, yeah. <laughs> no, shoulda, woulda, coulda. All right, let's see. I do them. <clears throat> Well, maybe I do want, I'll just do one like this in the center and it will just look nice. And then it's like, okay, which way do I want to be? It, since it's all even, which way do I want to be up and which way do I want to be down? Wow, even my border was pretty even. I should go play the lottery or something. I'm doing so good. I, I'm doing the whole, well, actually, I'm doing two halves since I know I'm going to do them back to back. I'm just taking care of it all at one shot here. Of course, I start looking at this and then I think, oh, I just saw something else I could do. <laughs> Which changes the whole look of the whole thing, but that's okay. That's yeah. And that's then, what yeah. We do here. Exactly. And, you know, I'm saying in, in other shading ideas, so like I, and you did the same. Well, no, you did new colors in at the tip. So I came from the tips with the shading. And then in these little teeny sections, I did a little bit of shading just because i that's the way I wanted it to look. I don't know what I'm going to do in these the, the other little bits yet. But um, Hey, Heather, I have a question for you. Did yeah. you draw in black and then just use blue chalk pencil there? Oh, no, this is all blue. Oh, it is. Okay. I thought I was imagining things. I'm like, wait a minute. Didn't she start in black? No. Oh, no thank you. <laughs> it's just fever I've had for two, you know, for a week. I don't know what's going on. Your eyes are thank delirious. You. That's right. 
when when she when you when you just have the lines on it is hard to tell that it's blue yeah, yeah. it looked really thank you sheree i'm not nuts it really looked oh. black and then suddenly i looked over and i went wait a minute it's blue that's yeah it's this uh what is this uh it's an old microsoft uh camera webcam and, and well, yeah, it's like when, when in the camera <laughs> oh it, well like well this can you see that it's brown oh i can see that it's brown yes yeah, if I can see it's brown, no problem. Black. Except yeah. your original lines look black. They were black, right? No, they are. The original lines okay. are black, but I did brown in the diamond. Yeah, yeah I can see that. Yep. Yeah. Because yeah. usually, is yeah, brown. yeah, and usually I, you know, what I would do on the Renaissance tile, everything just looked black, and then when I moved it, oh, you'd see this glimmer of color. But uh, after, well, no, maybe I'll wait till Steve gets back, and then I'll mess with. Uh, this other camera and uh and a setting that i have to figure out i don't want to goof anything up but it's a way nicer so are you saying you have a new camera that's just sitting there i well it's not it's a it's a it's an older camera still you know we we, we just we just scavenge everything oh uh, good it's, okay. it's a newer camera a very nice camera and um and it's like yep it's just sitting here waiting we tried it. It's like okay, it's got all these fancy settings, and um, I'm like, okay, great, but it won't. Uh, I it won't let me access the settings, and I'm like, well, this is not helpful. But then I looked at some help, and it said, well, go here and delete this, and I was like, oh no, I've heard of those things before. Don't delete anything, you know, just, unless you have an expert handy, and. Uh, and so that's what that's what we'll try because as I, like I said it was a really nice nice quality and the colors were real nice on it and i'm like oh this will be great sure <laughs> well i tell you what when you get all of the lines going it can be a little bit of a eyeball instead of a like a tongue tangler or the eyeball tangler <laughs> yeah you just have to kind of concentrate on each little square yeah but I, I really like the the one that um oh, whoever did it was it storm that did it from the center whoever did it from oh, the center. Yeah. yeah yeah not me i'm just a voyeur <laughs> and i like i like uh the, so here who did it from both sides yeah that's that's neat too Mm-hmm. Yes, I think I'm going to do the same here. And neat how it, you know, kind of, um, I, okay, I'm happy with the way I did that. We'll just do the shading the same. And, um, or, now nah, I like shading better than filling all the way in. See, I packed all my pens away so I don't touch this. Why? Because I'm done. I'm telling myself oh, I'm I, I done. packed them away just now. Yes, just now. <laughs> I was I like, them away did you pack them so away? I wouldn't touch it anymore. <laughs> I just <laughs> sit here and watch you. Because <laughs> it's so tempting, but I like what you did. That I like the, the lines. Yeah, um, I like the way it, it turned out. Yeah, yeah, it's different. It's sort of. Depending on how you look at it, if you look at the bumps, to me it kind of looks like a windmill-ish. But then if you, you can follow that curve and then I see like a, a circle. Mm -hmm. I, I like it. I like it. Yeah. Well, and sometimes it's kind of fun to do to do something like that that's just completely out of out of our norm, I suppose. Um, yeah, oh, versus having like things symmetrical. This would be a neat one to carve into clay and make into tiles. Oh, we'll see. Joyce is on. So, Joyce, you heard it here first. And so, next OPC uh, pottery. <laughs> and she, Joyce doesn't take pottery. <laughs> oh, okay. Never mind. She could tell everybody else about it. <laughs> but I could, but I could probably uh, be talked into it sometime. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fun! That's oh, neat. Oh, that looks so neat. 
It does, and I almost don't want to do anything else. Are you on a white tile? Yeah. Oh, because it looks gray in the picture. Yeah. Well, here, let me... Because um, I was going to say, oh, yeah, now it doesn't. <laughs> it does, yeah. Because mine is gray, and in, in the picture, it looks white. Yeah. I, I, I was saying, of... you can have some white. Well, that's, yeah, that's what I was, like, realizing, like, oh, no, I can't add any white, because I... Well, you could I make those... white tile. You could make those what became orbs in the middle into gems. See, I was just thinking that same thing. They're, they're, they're maybe requiring some. some and actually, you could, make, you could make all the little diamonds into gems. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And even all the ones going around. Because I had thought about doing that too, but changed my mind quickly. Yes, cute. So um for Sharon that's new when you want to make them look shiny and you you get your white uh, gel pen whichever brand. That's all you need to do. So just put a little swish mark. Okay. <laughs> He's like sold. <laughs> I do need to put it. What's that? Gorgeous. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I put to put a disclaimer. Not responsible for any, <laughs> any um shopping binges that one might go on after. <laughs> Actually, I should have just uh, turned that tie. I'm, I'm doing these all on the same side, that making that good, up. Though. Okay, because usually I turn it and do it on the same side regardless. I'll just confuse things and I'll do it on these. This I'll just put a little dot. Well, or sort of a dot. Where are you guys located? So we're in Michigan. Michigan, okay. okay. Yeah, and where are you? Uh, I'm in Ottawa, um, Ontario, Canada. Okay, great. Well, we're we're close to Ontario. Yeah. 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 <laughs> well, I'm in Ypsilanti, and and Mom is in Rochester Hills, so we're and, and both not that far from the border. We have to go Thank south you. to go to Ontario, or <laughs> or 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 we could go east to go to Ontario. Right. Okay. What's the what's what is the city south, Heather? When you go across the bridge, Sarnia? No, no, not oh. not that bridge. The other bridge, the, the, Windsor. Yeah, Windsor, Windsor. Ontario. See, yeah. I forgot the yeah. Windsor part. Yeah. yeah, yeah. We go south to go to Windsor, Ontario. Okay. I think yeah, I'm right. Toronto, and then you hit um, get to Ottawa four hours later. So, oh. Ah! Might be a bit closer to me than Niagara Falls. Mm. And we have Zelda is in Toronto, and I don't know if uh, we have a number from. Oh, and oh, Patricia's in Sarnia. Oh, but oh, okay, gotcha. Nice. All right. Well, I want to see what everybody has done. I, I think I'm going to leave mine the way it is and not put anything in those other places. I, I wouldn't, Heather. It really looks pretty. I, I think it's neat. All right. Excited. Wow. wow. <laughs> nice. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> Look at oh, I want to see Tom like a fighting. fighting. Oh, go ahead. Felicity's looks like a shield, like a armor oh, shield. God. This is what it makes me think of. Like hammered yeah. metal. Those orbs in there look like it's hammered. Yeah. Oh, so neat. Oh, and look at Sharon's. Look at Here's everybody's. Look too. Looks good. Looking good. Looking oh. good. Oh, man. I wish I could get pictures of these. Well, you, oh, you, well, you will. I, I have I have half of it done already. So this weekend, since I'm not going to be bothered by my other half, I plan to get it out. Um, oh, Alyssa! Soon. 
how neat that oh. is just one big one and then yeah oh yes all right, Wonderful so hold them steady. I'm going to grab a pick, get grab the the shot here. So hold them, yeah, or, yeah. Pick which way's up and hold it steady. And uh, wow, oh my lord! And let me make sure I got it. I did. Okay, so let me. Um, I love that. Alyssa. These are all. Oh, and then Shulamit. I like yours. I just saw it's. Oh, oh, I can scroll it down. Okay. Um, say so for those that are on the Everything's Facebook. Everything's just whoa. I'm getting dizzy. <laughs> Let me share my screen, and I got um, Mary and Kay. I got yours also. Um, was mine straight? I, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it was. It was. Yeah, let me share. It looked crooked. Screen. And um, but yeah, see so if you're on the Facebook group, uh, you know, and you put post it on there, and I will swipe it from there. Or if you want to email me, I'll put that in the chat here really quick. Um, because then on my recap, I will put these all on the post and um and share it out to everybody that was well everybody that was in the call that i usually get to last if you subscribe to my blog um you go to, to tangleaddicts.com and just you know click the follow me put your email address in then you'll get it as soon as i post it um, okay wow so yeah so just look at i mean just so many neat ideas and this is one I just love this. Is it the same tangle and look at all the different tapes. <laughs> you would never know oh, it. <laughs> no. And let me let me scroll this nice nicer down here so that way we can see everybody's names. Just gorgeous. Because I mean the screenshot's never gonna really capture what, you know, when you take the picture yourself, but it's close. Close enough. And and, and mine sideways. Oh yeah, but it looks neat though. <laughs> I'll send you a photo of it. Okay, sounds the good. other way. <laughs> and oh yeah, you were mentioning Zelda. I like the what Zelda did there. Yes, of course you do. It looks yeah. like Knightsbridge. <laughs> it does. <laughs> 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 just doesn't like all the coloring, the, all the filling in. <laughs> Very neat. Oh, and then I looking Shulamit's down there. I, I just got it. Just got part of it. So, and I think Shulamit, you're on the. You're on the Facebook group, I think, or email it to me because I want to get the full picture of it. But that looks neat. I was going to accuse Joyce of doing Knightsbridge too, but that's it's different what she did. It looks like <laughs> it looks almost like they're braided, the way it alternates, yeah, and the, way, like the way she has it curved. But I'm I was afraid... I was trying for John Quill. <laughs> oh yes, trying for what? For John Quill. Yeah, John, John, John Cole. I see that. Do you? Did, did I yeah. do it right? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Well, you know, I can't remember anything day to day, Close. but it looks right to me. <laughs> I can't remember. Yeah, because yeah, John Cole is it's it's uh they're on the angle, and you have like white, solid, and gray, and and the graphite, if I remember right. But it looks it, cool, it was especially with the shine. Yeah, it uh, it looks like a picture of something like a physical something, like a wall hanging. It's, these are all just absolutely gorgeous. Wow! Uh, ow. And I see so it looks like like so yeah we were using the the stir it up and I oh see uh, it looks like Tom used it I can't see in, in Carla's background if you had used that but several have used that but I like this. Jen did the print tops in the background. How neat is that? Wow. With the gray. Oh, these are, what neat ideas. Yeah, who would know that this is the same tangle? Huh. <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> but when Deb's I post it, I would make sure to uh, tag, tag him on his Instagram. <laughs> Deb did what I did, except she put her the little bumps on the outside edge and i did mine on the inside oh. and i like i like how the center ended up better than mine so next time yeah. i'll do it that way <laughs> yeah uh, so <laughs> i don't even want to calculate how many different ways it's kind of like the combinations of numbers oh you know we can say goodbye to the to the recording at this point um